If I were to mention donkeys, then what would come to mind? Shrek. <laughs> <laughs> no, I would think of like a farm with like loads of donkeys chilling yeah. out. Yeah. Carrying people. Yeah. yeah, they've actually been helping humans for thousands of years. Mm -hmm. And there's some really bad news at the moment that donkeys are now under serious threat. Really? Oh. Yeah. Braden's got this exclusive report from South Africa on how donkeys are being slaughtered at an alarming rate. I've never been on a plane this small and it's really awesome. But for a serious reason, I'm travelling to a remote part of the country to highlight a terrible animal trade. I've come to the Karoo Desert to visit a unique sanctuary, home to well over 200 donkeys. <coughs> the owner, Jono, showed me around. All right, let's have a look. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. Woo -woo. This is an amazing view, isn't it? It's beautiful. Every animal you see out there, Bray, they're all rescued. All of them rescued from slaughter, and now they've got really? a life of retirement. That's awesome. Right, how close do you think we could get to We can it? go if we walk slowly. I'll show you how close. That's Penelope. How Penelope. Amazingly, Jono seems to know all these donkeys by name. Say hi, oh, Leanna. 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 She's cute, huh? All of them are cute. So lovable. I just want to take him home. But sadly, donkeys are being targeted in massive numbers for the skins, which contain a gelatin-like substance used in traditional Chinese medicines. Campaigners say that in just five years' time, the world's donkeys may be close to extinction. There are 44 million donkeys in the world, and the current Chinese demand is a whopping 10 million wow. per year. So it's a very bad situation because what happens is um, all these donkeys are being killed, skinned, and then sent off to China where they make this medicine called the Jawa. There were only four donkeys at the Karoo Sanctuary when Jono heard about hundreds more about to be brutally killed. It was never really our intention to become the largest donkey rescue in Africa. Then an auction happened and then we ended up buying all these donkeys and that is why we went from four to over 300. That's a lot of donkeys. You are such a nice man. You must have a big heart to be doing this. Why, thank you, sir. Donkeys are vital to African villages, taking children to school and helping collect water and firewood. But charities say gangs are now buying up the animals or stealing them in the night, leaving villagers without a living. It's hard to imagine a world without these beautiful donkeys. But yet again, humans are thoughtlessly taking an animal to the brink of extinction. Network for Animals is calling for an immediate worldwide ban on the export of donkey skins to China. Braden's actually back in Britain and we'll be hearing from him later in the show. Yeah, here is Team Man City, you know, they haven't been doing too badly. <laughs>